package package opening <sighs> I would have never thought that um, reading the original comic book and all that that one day that Warner Brothers would actually make the fucking film in animated form and I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys will know what I'm talking about it's not supposed to be released until Tuesday, so I'm, I'm freaking lucky right now. On a Friday and two weeks vacation. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what, a, what a good start for a vacation, all that. What a good start. And I got the ultimate edition of it. With the Joker and everything. Uh, Batman the Killing Joke. Based on the number one New York Times best-selling graphic novel. And the Joker figurine is for 13 and up. So, yeah, if you're 12, you can't have the, that, that figurine. So, uh, let's see. Let's open this right here. Wow, just look at this. How evil the Joker looks. For sure. For sure the figurine and all that. Uh, got the film. The Killing Joke. Oh my god. I'm going to go watch it right now when I finish this video. Um, oh my god. I'm so stoked to see this, this thing. Mm. Oh, damage the figurine and all that. But anyways. The Joker. So. Uh, yeah, okay. There you go. So, let's see a couple of the special features they have. Exclusively to Blu-ray, Batman, The Killing Joke, The Many Shades of the Joker featurette. Madness, set to music featurette from DC Comic Vault to bonus comics and all that. And uh, DC Universe's next animated uh, movie, which I don't know right now. Um, it's probably going to be uh, either the Aquaman movie, uh, an Aquaman movie, or uh, something like that. But this right here, uh, the story of uh, the Joker and everything, is one of the most disturbing things that ever happened to Gordon to Commissioner Gordon and all that. Um, the thing, the things that the Joker does to Commissioner Gordon and all that is really messed up. And he really, truly did it. Um, well, it's 14A. We're not that strict in Canada, so um, we're strict a little, but not, not as strict as, uh, as uh, probably in the States and all that. But yeah, yeah. Um, Love the cover to this. Really, really love the cover. Um, it looks a lot, a lot scarier than the original cover of uh, the graphic novel. So, um, I would highly recommend, please support this uh, type of stuff. If we can get, it's not that I support violence and support a lot of violent films and all that. But a lot of stories from the DC universe and all that should be um, what the original story used to be. Uh, a violent, bloody mess sometimes. I'm not saying every time, but it, it should be. The original story probably changed, do something 360 or something like that. But yeah. Um, <laughs> the one thing 
is I looked on Amazon and I went to the mailbox and everything and I okay <laughs> and I was asking dad and saying did I receive a package today yeah it's on the table right there I couldn't believe it oh my god uh yeah I, I still have I still have this one wow it has a lot of uh, dust on it <laughs> Batman bad blood uh My Nightwing is going to go uh, really well with uh, the Joker. So, yeah. <laughs> Not the biggest collector of uh, these figurines and all that, but still, it's uh, it's awesome. Um, Night Nightwing I really love. I wish that they would do just an entire film of Nightwing and all that. How he became Nightwing and all that. How pretty much he got pissed at Bruce and just really left and everything. And just really um, a story of uh, of his beginning and all that. So, so yeah. Um, I don't really know too much what other stories they could really do um, in the Batman universe and all that. I, I know there's... Not, not the Batman, just the Batman universe and all that, but other uh, universes and all that, like... Superman, Aquaman, Wonder Woman, uh, all sorts of universes they, they can do and all that. So, so yeah, that's pretty much what I have to uh, <laughs> to say tonight. So, good day, everybody, or good night.